Just feel the power of all the greatness. It's comics and shots. Today's subject, The Flash. The comics, the movies, the TV shows. Let's get into it. Comic books. Liking it so far, but... About 2012, they introduced a new Wally West, you know, after the new 52. The original version got wiped away by time travel nonsense, you know how it is. And you know, they call the, like, uh, the new one, Wally West 2. Then they called him Wallace West. And now he's Ace West, and that's a cool name. But it's a cool name for, uh, well, not a lame character, but a character who doesn't really do much nowadays. He was a member of, like, two, technically three Teen Titans teams, and now he's just sitting in the background. Sad thing is, he has a backstory, too. Possibly dead mom, definitely dead dad, who was also the reverse Flash. Are we gonna resolve that? Probably not. It's DC Comics. But hopefully, yes. Always have hope with comics. Sometimes they surprise you. Most of the time they disappoint, but sometimes there's a surprise. <sighs> On to the movies. I refuse to watch that live action debacle, because if I wanted to just watch the Flashpoint Paradox, I'd watch the superior animated version any time of the week, which had a badass Suicide Squad sequel. You just watched a man scratch his nose. That's your life. That's a, you know, it's real. Yeah. That movie was really cool, especially the Suicide Squad one, the sequel, or like uh, Hell to Pay. Love that one. Such a bizarre animated cinematic universe. It, a culmination of direct adaptations and original stories meshed together in a horrifying Frankenstein of content. Yes. Also, for some reason, Damian Wayne and Raven get together. That's just weird. Don't worry, they're the same age in that universe, but... It's like, it's just kind of one of those things that randomly happened. I don't know. I just do not know. Ugh. Back to the Flash. I hope... I, it's, is it weird to say that I hope for a sequel to the CW version? Maybe, like, something with good special effects? Maybe an animated sequel. I definitely want a sequel to Legends of Tomorrow. Of course, who doesn't? And with John Diggle finally getting his goddamn Green Lantern ring. Ugh. They teased him having a ring for like a year and it just like disappeared. It's like, really man? Really? Lame. Ugh. As for Barry, I'm honestly okay with him retiring. Jay, I'm glad he's out of retirement, and I'm glad he has a daughter again. Well, he has a daughter now. They made it so that he originally had a daughter the entire time, but she was erased by time travel nonsense. Comics. Yeah. That's the Flash for you. It's all weird, crazy bullshit made off of uh, lore that is based on just adding to stuff as it going along. Similar to Spider-Man. Probably better than Spider-Man. Yeah, Flash's lore is definitely better than Spider-Man's lore, just objectively. Just objectively. That's all you gotta know. Objectivity. When you wanna be a lawyer for space marines? Yeah. I'm Mick the Man, aka Mick the Nerd. This has been the rambling nonsense that has been comics and shots. Like, comment, and subscribe. Praise be to the Blood Elk.